I'm sure you're the same way as me. Yeah. If you're if you if you've been a Clipper fan long enough, you don't talk crap. Never, never. I think that the, the never. Yeah, the, never. the the crap talking Clipper fans are the Lob City era. Yes. And I even I even get annoyed by them sometimes. Yeah. I make this comparison, which is very offensive to my ancestors, <laughs> but it's it's like being a black person who lived through the 30s, 40s, and 50s. And then getting to the 60s and 70s and seeing black people like get buck with white guys and being like, whoa, 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 take it easy. We don't need to talk like that. Like, that's how I was with like when like Lob City fans would talk crap to Laker fans. I'm like, hold on, let's let's take it easy. We don't need to engage with that stuff. Like, that doesn't that doesn't end well for us because yeah, we don't have much to talk about. I agree. I mean, I always felt like when when I would see on Twitter people trying to dunk on Lakers fans, I was like, guys, I don't mean to be Marty McFly here, but I've seen the future. Yes, <laughs> uh, this is never. It might work out for us eventually, but it's definitely not. We should not be confident enough to be saying these things. And this season, to me, with it being you know shut down early, these sort of bylaws that we're hearing about that would make the Lakers champions makes me so angry because they're the only fans in the world who would probably celebrate it yeah oh absolutely they would celebrate it but I, you just you just taught me something new why wouldn't the bucks be champion there's based on a certain amount of wins and what it was at a certain point it's not like what it was to the last day which is even weirder that's absolute crap that is crap if that, <laughs> that would be so terrible yeah but the last game happened and i didn't get any text yeah. from my laker fan friends when they beat us and also i watched that game and i go LeBron put in that much work. Anthony Davis was lackluster. Avery Bradley went off for 27 points. Oh, my gosh. I think we are about to win a championship. Yeah. <laughs> I felt it, like, at that moment. Like, I was like, they're not going to be able to survive. I, like, I, I know we're going to get through the playoffs, and these guys are not going to be able to survive a seven-game series playing like that. 